So if you remember, last week we discussed the three categories of microphones. You have the too inexpensive to be effective, too expensive for any normal person to afford, and the sweet spot. Today I'm going to quickly give you three examples of good microphones in that sweet spot that you might want to consider if you're looking to dramatically improve your sound. Number one, the Shure SM7B. This microphone is really, really solid for beginners and usually runs about $400. Now remember, for any of these microphones, you will need an interface, a little box that goes between the microphone and your computer. That's part of the reason it sounds so good. A good budget-friendly option interface would be the Scarlett, running for about $100. Number two, a Rode NT1. This mic is a little bit more budget-friendly, but still sounds pretty good. Now it might not sound quite as crisp as the Shure or look as professional, but the NT1 goes for about $240 and might be a good addition as a budget-friendly option. And finally, my personal favorite is, hey, this mic right here. It's the Electro Voice E320. This mic is really good, especially for radio broadcasters because it drowns out a lot of noise around you and really just focuses on what I'm saying. And my board also processes through this microphone really, really nicely too. I really like this microphone sound and it's in a decent budget range for good microphones of about $450. There are many places to get microphones, whether that be through the manufacturer themselves or my personal favorite online store, Sweetwater. Start with these three mics if you're looking for a good recommendation, but by no means is this a comprehensive list of every good mic out there. Reach out for more and we can have a conversation on how to improve your audio.